Shalom, all praises, honor, and glory. It goes to Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rakak Kradash, the Balana City Apostles, the Balana City Elders of Great Millstone, Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Brakatham to the whole full act, Shalom, Shalom. Today's video is going to be entitled Yahweh Shai comes to bring the sword of judgment, but also the sword of division. And the uh, inspiration for this video, you know, was reading Matthew 10. You know, this 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 one liner stuck out. You know, think that I come, think not that I am come to send peace on earth. I come not to send peace, but a sword. You see, you know, and the prophetic breakdown that you know we all go into is that when Yahweh Shah returns, he's gonna be on war mode. You know, scriptures say the day of vengeance burneth in my heart. You read Isaiah the 63rd chapter. You say he he, he <laughs> who is this that coming from Edom with dyed garments from Basra, man? <laughs> How did he get those garments by by bloodshed? When you read in Revelation, say the Lamb, you say he he doth judge and make war. You understand? These are the qualities of of the Messiah's return. People think you know the Messiah's return is a is a damn uh, <coughs> cookout, is a damn uh, celebration. Amos 5 tells you that, woe to them that desire the day of the Lord, for what end is it for you? For the day of the Lord is darkness and not light. Right? Now we all know that the prophetic breakdown of that. But read it one more time. Matthew 10 verse 34, think that I am not come to send peace on earth. I come, I came not to send peace, but a sword. Like I said, Yahweh Shah kings to bring the sword of division. Whether it's amongst close members of your family, whether it's amongst people you know in the world, or whether it's amongst complete strangers. When you when you walk in the presence of Yahweh Shah, when you walk in the Holy Spirit. Things like that you experience, and that's that's why he elaborates in Matthew 10, verse 35. I came not, I came for I came to set a man in variance against his father, and a daughter against her mother, and a daughter in law against her mother in law, and a man's foes shall be they of his own household. See, but it, it grows to even bigger than that because eventually there's going to be a time of persecution. It's <coughs> like you. It's going to be a time of persecution to where it's going to be bigger than members of our own household. We're going to have members of whole cities, thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands of people against us because Yahweh Shah came to bring that division. And ultimately, we speak the words of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah. <clears throat> Hebrews 11 tells you that the word of the Most High is a sharp sword. You know, piercing the dividing asunder of soul and spirit, man. So, you know, when we have that, when we have that time where we're put on trial, scriptures say, think, uh, think not what thou shalt say when thou art brought up before judges and kings. <laughs> and, you know, <laughs> who's to say the spirit, spirit might have us get on somebody ass, spirit might have us straight condemn people, man, because obviously the most important mission. Uh, of this ministry is to gather the elect But part of the ministry Is to condemn the world man So when you're around people Whether they know you in the truth or not They they get offset by your spirit man I find myself sometimes When I when I go into a restaurant <clears throat> Shit This shit happened yesterday man I, <laughs> I went to fucking Chick-fil-A I went, went in to sit down You know when I when I sat down, the whole fucking place is crowded. You know, as soon as I sat down for like 15 minutes, everybody cleared out. It's, it'd be like a whole, <laughs> a whole circle around you, just empty. But the whole whole other restaurant is clear, and I've noticed that, man. <laughs> if you 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 be in public, sometimes it feel like people create a space around you, and that that's the spirit. You know, the 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 demons and the evil spirits on these people. You know, whether they know it or not create that division because they can't handle being around such high energy of the Holy Spirit. Mm -hmm. They can't handle being around, you know, righteousness. John 15 <clears throat> verse 18 if the, uh, 
verse 17 these things i command you that ye love one another if the world hate you ye you know that it hated me before it hated you yeah we have to love one another because nobody else is going to show us this type of love nobody else understands the uh the the division nobody else understands the uh the setbacks you know nobody understands the feeling of being an outcast other than a brother in Yahweh Shai who experiences the same things. If the world hate you, you know that it hated me before it hated you. If you were of the world, the world would love his own. Right. If if we were of the world looking like niggas, acting like niggas, talking like niggas, conducting ourselves like niggas, we would be accepted. But because you're not of the world, I have but I have chosen you out of the world, therefore the world hated you and ate. <laughs> Call all you how about Shemiah Shah. That's that's your Howard Shah bringing the sword of division by taking us out of the world and and cutting us off from that uh from that familiar familiar familiarity. <laughs> I always have trouble with that word from being familiar with the world because you know Jake on the outside they may they may see you as a regular guy, but they don't feel you as a regular guy. You understand? Says, but I have chosen you out of the world, therefore the world hateth you. Remember the word that I say unto you: the servant is not greater than his than his lord. If they have persecuted me; they will also persecute you. If they have kept my saying, they will keep yours also. But all these things will they do unto you for my name's sake, because they know not him that sent me. With that, a Lord will this edify all praises, honor, and glory. It goes to Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai Bahashim, Rakakwidash. The blind of city apostles, the blind of city elders of great millstone. How about Shemel Shah? Break it down to the full act. Shalom, shalom.